Good day. Welcome. This is your Daily Med with Lady V. We have looked at seven mystery parables in St. Matthew chapter 13. And as we look at uh, mystery parable number eight, we will see what Jesus says in closing out this part of his discourse in St. Matthew 13, verse 51 and 52. So today he is telling us about a trained man and his treasure. This treasure is a treasury of truth and we will see that from our lesson so as jesus ended these parables by comparing the person who values things both old and new it signifies the truths revealed before crisis time he says that they should be treasured along with truths he himself has now revealed to his uh, disciples. So the eighth mystery parable in this discourse illustrates the fact that the kingdom of heaven, the truths are a mixture of uh, the old and the new doctrines or testaments which will enable the disciples to be qualified scribes in the realm of profession. And he tells us today about the householder. He is the same man as in all the other parables. He is the same man as in parable number one with the seed and the sower that tells us about the different classes of hearers. In parable number two, he is the same man with the parable of the tears and the weeds or the weeds and the wheat and we see the mixing of good and bad. In the third parable of the mustard seed, we see the abnormal growth. In parable number four of the leaven, we see how the truths have been corrupted. In parable number five, we see in the hidden treasure, Israel's present state. In parable number six, we see the pearl of great price, the church's phase of the kingdom. Then in parable number seven, we see the parable of the dragnet or the catching of the fish, the unusual effects of truth. And so today when we look at parable number eight, as it were, in St. Matthew 13, verse 51 and verse 52, it says, Jesus said unto them, Have ye understood all these things? Referring to the seven parables that has been told in this same chapter of St. Matthew chapter 13. They say unto him, Yea, Lord. Yes, Lord. Then said he unto them, Therefore every scribe which is instructed unto the kingdom of heaven is like unto a man that is an outholder which bringeth forth out of his treasure things new and things hold. 
so what jesus is here saying to the disciples he's saying to you and i today as his disciples he's saying to the teachers he's saying to the preachers he's saying to the evangelists he's saying to the apostles he's saying to the prophets he's saying to the pastors he's saying to each and every one of us his followers that we must thoroughly understand truth and be able to dispense this truth abroad just as he has said to his disciples in verse 51 and 52 he is saying this or there is a mixture of old and new and this man out of his treasury brought forth both old and new so when he had finished the seven previous parables the master teacher asked his disciples if they understood what he was trying to say to them he knew they might have understand the hold and now he is revealing new truth what is this truth about it concerns the kingdom of heaven they understood and they said yes master we understand what great reply that was the question before us today as his disciples can we confidently say like these disciples yes master teacher we understand because he wants us to understand both the truths that are in the old and the truth in the new and he wants us to understand with confidence that we know what we are saying and we know what we are dispersing or dispensing when we give the word of God because they say they understood now they were obligated to share this truth with others as his disciples the same question is to us and if we understand he is saying to us we have the same obligation because the disciples whether they are of old or we are today the followers of christ we are to be channels not terminals of blessings or the truth of the gospel so the 12 were now scribes as we see from the lesson trained for the kingdom of heaven that is teachers and interpreters of the truth they were like a householder the bible says who brings out of his treasure things that are new and the things that are old in the old testament they had a rich deposit of what we might call old truth in the present time in the new testament time we see that jesus was saying to them here is some mystery i am solving for you i'm explaining what the truth of this is so in the parabolic teaching of christ they had just received that which was completely new to them from this vast storehouse of knowledge the treasury they should now impart the glorious truth to others 
the same is also required of us we must spread the truth the good news of the gospel of the kingdom of heaven he says we should use that which we know from the old testament and we should also use that which is being revealed to us by him from the new testament so as we have heard these last seven parables being interpreted which should not remain a mystery anymore to us as his disciples he is saying to us go spread the news both that which is learned from the whole and that which is now being revealed as new god bless you thank you again for watching please like please subscribe please share and don't forget to visit my youtube channel daily med with lady v